Hey, I'm Decathlon Gamer. Welcome back to PCM21 Stage Racer. We're on episode number 22. We kick off our first World Tour stage race. So, really excited for this one as we are at the Tour de Suisse. The unfortunate thing about this opening time trial is it's not a time trial, it's a prologue. I'm a better time trialist than prologuer, but I do have a decent prologue addition today as we push into the final three kilometers on this one. It looks like based on number that I have been selected as the team leader considering my specialty that should be the case anyway but you know we'll see if we can get a decent time as we approach the line maxing things out push 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 sixth place three seconds down that's where I want to be there's only a handful of riders to go after me so this could and should be a pretty decent time Filippo Ghana goes top, but I am in the top 10. Eighth place, I needed a top 20 on the stage, so that's a good start. I'll take it. Seven seconds down overall, but Ghana, not the threat. Scottson, not the threat. Uh, are we even surrounded by really any GC threats, or am I in the best GC position? Embro maybe could be a competitor overall. I scottson maybe i i don't know i i don't think any of these guys are going to necessarily threat threaten the gc so am i the first gc name hmm. we'll see that's only one stage down though there are seven more to go following three straight sprint stages the rest of this race is action throughout we've got three mountain stages and then we have a time trial to wrap this thing up so it's stage five now and <laughs> I'm finding myself in a situation that I actually quite like. We're 40 kilometers in and the breakaway is not properly established. There's four riders, they've got a minute and a half, but we're still chasing them. And so you look at the team, Jones, Holoesco, Barbosa, already Toast. There's already riders getting dropped and more and more and more riders are going backwards. The Peloton has been chasing hard. Now, even though I have a little bit of fatigue, it's very little as we begin an all's cat climb, the first of this tour. So this fatigue in the legs, and especially if we continue to chase those four guys, is going to destroy the field pretty early and really, really establish the pure climbers and the GC much earlier than expected in this stage and it's going to put me in a strong position because most of these guys are going to lose their teammates much earlier than they would otherwise Jones already out the back so we've got Joyce we've got Mannion and I need them to actually just get up here and do what they can do get them up here Yep, no, Mannion's not going to make it. Just back to your auto. Joyce is here. He is offering me a little bit of protection. We're halfway up this first climb. Breakaway's gone. We're down to 123, and the group's just getting smaller and smaller and smaller. Now, yes, I'm going to be isolated. I'm going to be alone. And you can see there's four Ineos riders right at the top all working together. But Gegenhardt's their leader. Well, yes, Gegenhardt's the leader because Ghana's working on the front, and he's wearing the number one jersey. It, and there's a lot of guys in this field, in this pack, as I am now alone and we're down to 43. There's a lot of guys in this field that this isn't the strongest Tour de Suisse that you could potentially see. This is a fairly weak group. In fact, I could go forward right now and do a little bit of work myself and keep the pressure on and thin this peloton out a little bit more without really hurting myself I mean heart rate's 163 I could go a little harder than this 1k to go to the top in fact I could get KOM lead here and lead this thing over the top down to 14 this is what I was going for this is what I was aiming for and now I could just sit on and let somebody else take it up I just picked up 20 points in the KOM so that's fantastic I'm down to an elite group there's 11 behind. I'm hoping that there's some sort of cooperation, some sort of anything that's going to keep this down to, say, 25 max. The one group behind us may be making contact, but this is already setting me up for a potential top 10 in the race overall. 
potentially the jersey at the end of the day if we finish with a small group. Uh, Serrano and Bookman. Bookman goes down. Serrano, no big deal, but Bookman definitely one of the six or seven top contenders. And we're now sitting with 10, 11 guys. Ballerini, Port, Lobato. Behind that, Rubio. So I've recovered fairly well, not fully recovered. And if I haven't fully recovered, you know that others have not fully recovered. So the race looking really, really good. 11 riders now here in contention. If that gap starts to come down, which it is, it's coming down. We need to get on the driver's seat. We need to keep... Ah, oh, now it's back to 35. Now it's down to 2. Now it's 34. They're chasing. 47k to go. Down to 3. Gegenhart, Port, and I. Will we work together? Yes, we will work together. This is fantastic if we can keep this thing away from everybody else. Now just 4 chasing. This is what I want to see. Yes, sir. May I have another? Okay, I need water. Give them a turn. Let them take over for a second. They are cooperating, are they not? They are not. Now it's six. Poles, Volter, Rubio. We're seeing an attack. Okay, second over the top. That's good points again. Now sitting on 28. Recovery ongoing. Look good. Let's speed things up for a little bit. We've got quite a while before uh, we get into that final climb. Now up to eight riders, but it's a healthy gap behind us, though it's coming down really fast. Uh, nobody wanting to cooperate. I'm fully recovered now with nine riders here. I mean, come on. We've got to work together, guys. I'm fully recovered, so keep that heart rate low. Okay, okay. So far, so good. Nine riders. Nobody's going to cooperate except for me. That's that's pretty bad. And this is costing me right now. But the other riders are coming back at us. I mean, what, what am I to do? If I go over this line first, that's three seconds. I'll take it. But I've got to recover. Sit up. This is going to let the others come back. Now we're at 11. Still sitting up. This sucks. Where's the help? Where's the cooperation? I cannot just kill myself to get us further ahead of a couple chasers, but this is going to get back to 24 riders all of a sudden. Ah, this is so lame. So lame. All right. 13K. Here we go. Final climb coming up. 24 riders now. Six more coming. Ah. We've lost two minutes on this descent because nobody else wants to work. 11K. Screw these guys. Okay, now we ride. Force them to chase. 10k to go. I can't continue at that pace, but this is putting a lot of pressure on that group to burn a lot of energy early in the climb. Gel gel early we want to maintain this for a while back together attack again okay back to effort up we reopen the gap don't let them actually get on it's 8k this is too much too long okay it's down to 21 6k 21 riders. Uh, I think I did too much too early. Follow, follow, follow. And there's an attack at the front. He could go all the way. Oi! Wow, that was such a waste. Follow Gegenhart. My Polonk. And I was too aggressive. I, I. Uh, I haven't played in too long. I was too eager. And we're out of energy where others are not. But that's because they were all patient. And I was not. 
Gosh, I'm, I'm usually so patient. What a waste. Have I given the way race away already? Such percentages mm, that the probably. Can create some gaps. Probably. Can we recover just a little bit? Heart rate's right there. Right there on the verge of recovery, but not quite happening for us on that part. I'll get a little edge right for the line. Nope. Can't even get that. Gegenhart, Port, Rubio. It's the descent. That descent absolutely pissed me off that we gave away two and a half, three minutes because nobody wanted to work. Are you kidding me? What? what come on, AI. I, I, just cut me some slack. We create a massive gap to everybody else behind. We, we've got a group of, what was it, seven, six? That could absolutely put the race away for everybody else with just tiny amounts of cooperation. And instead, they literally sit there and give away two and a half minutes and allow it back together to be a big group and then still unwilling to cooperate. And then I, as the idiot, be the only one who decides to do something. And then I, as an idiot, even worse, say, screw these guys if they're literally going to make me do... I, I'm not the favorite. I'm nowhere near the favorite here. I was, I was like sixth favorite overall. So I then single-handedly try to put the pressure on and nobody goes with me. So then I'm not back where we were before where it's three, four guys working some but not all and trying to go clear no i i'm solo where everybody else then decides to work together to chase back the one breakaway rider so i i got 20 middle fingers pointed my direction on that stage and man oh man did i uh i take their bs and run with it jeez <sighs> 13th on the stage uh, absolutely gave that one away but at the same time I mean we would have ended up with a peloton of 80 and then what you know <laughs> damned if you do damned if you don't on that one uh, but yeah I, I I took it right up the butt on that one jeez <laughs> oh man um uh, yeah, that, that was a total failure by the AI. I mean, just a, um, absolute failure by the AI because in real life, that scenario never, never would happen. You, you would never see zero riders out of a group of 30 want to work. You would never see that, ever. Somebody is not going to give away three four five minutes to the pack guaranteed you're never going to see one rider group of nine you're never going to see sorry you're never going to see zero riders working forcing the only player present to to do literally everything by themselves it's that's just ridiculous what if that's my rant let's move on at two minutes down, I sit in 10th place overall. I sit in third in the King of the Mountains, and that's really in my best chance at getting something substantial out of this race. The team has no actual objective, just that I'm the leader. So I'm going to use up some of my teammates. And Okay, Barbosa's already getting water. Good. I was about to send somebody to do that. As we go to begin the hard climb of the day, and then we have one final climb. That's, of course, because of the gap, the long, long flat distance in between. That's where the action's going to happen. But we do want to thin the peloton out over this climb. And I would love to see myself in a position to go over the top first place on this climb. But I'm definitely not going to attack this climb. All right, we're seeing a bit of an acceleration. Let's go ahead and respond on that. Jones is still offering protection for me right now and then I've got Mannion on my wheel he's the only teammate who can actually climb and I don't know why I'm going backwards so fast 
Okay, 79 is blinking red, apparently. Uh, we're saving a bit for the remainder of the slopes, but this is going to damage the field if they are pushing this hard, this fast, that I can't even keep up at an 82 with my climbing. I mean, today, my mountain's in 80. This is going to take a lot out of the lakes fast. Four riders off the back so far. And they're falling back pretty quick once they get dropped. I expect to see many, many more to get dropped in before we even hit the... Uh, the kink here where you get a little bit of a descent a little respite the before it really goes up the rest of the way Whoa, breakaway's the already been there. caught that's how fast we're going i slowly returning towards the top the pace feels like it's lifted somewhat i'm not blinking red anymore heart rate's not bad so i'm not having to work too hard to move up this is definitely gotten less intense but like I said it's the next climb that's gonna be the one to worry about so I'll take this for now we know that if I attack they'll follow let's have the AI has been in this race so far down to 113 there's still some pace here down to three riders Mannion needs to switch his well, actually, Joyce needs to take over, and then we'll get. I will be without support for the final climb because these guys are going to be gone here fairly soon. The peloton has slowed down a bit. Fact. That's enough. That's enough of that. Here we go. Plan of action. I'm not just going to sit back. Uh, let's go at 86. We'll get Mannion. And then Joyce. Joyce. Off you go, buddy. Inside 5K. Joyce done in a moment. We'll be on to Mannion. There you go. Set. Okay, off you go. Joyce. Auto. 4K, 74. If you thin out the group only so much, then there should still be somebody to take up the reins. 2.8K, plenty of time to recover. Two-man group, Richie Port and I have gone clear. That's going to put some pressure on the field to pull us back. And I'm just climbing, but it's going to decimate the uh, peloton. Now it's back together. 32 riders. I, I'm good with 30 or 40 this time with the uh, kind of ground we still have to cover. 1k to go to the top. I should still make it there. But the problem for me is that Port's following. And Port's going to pick up secondary points right behind me. Which means I'm still not even going to have the lead in the KOM. But this is what you need to do to have it. There you go. Port still leads. I'm three points behind. Group of 13, if we get cooperation this time, that would be fantastic. So I highly doubt it. Which will allow the riders to catch their breath. Well, let's hope there's no crashes on the descent. 18 riders now, one minute ahead. 16 chasing. Already recovered fairly well, and I'm the only one who goes down. I'm the only one! Oh my goodness, and we're out of the race. Injured. <sighs> Did I call it or what? Um, bad luck. First the AI treats me like garbage. And then I tra treated me like garbage reacting to the AI. And then when things seem to be going a little bit better. I called it, didn't I? Uh, things could be worse. And they are. Uh, that's going to do it for this race, obviously, as we are now injured. And that's going to do it for a little while on our season. Uh, I'll see you back when we're recovered from injury. I'm Decathlon Gamer. This one did not end how we like, but uh, like, comment, subscribe. I'll see you next time. Have a good one. Be safe out there. Bye for now.